Hey everybody, welcome. Today we'll be chatting about why knowing the difference between customer success and customer experience could go a long way in maximizing your subscription business strategy. We'll introduce you to a new asset class that could be very helpful to your efforts. If you find what I'm saying helpful, hit the like button. You should know that subscription businesses and traditional transactional businesses are different. Subscription businesses are all about creating environments where customers find value. Customers need to be provided with new offerings that satisfy unanticipated challenges constantly. You can think of this as being hyper-competent. Customers want to feel like they are being guided along a path that will lead them to achieving their goals and arriving at their desired destination, even if they're not sure what that destination is. This leads us to why knowing the difference between customer success and customer experience is important. A lot of smart people tend to confuse customer success and customer experience. This can lead new subscription makers to think that they are working on a customer success challenge when they're actually working on a customer experience problem. For the record, customer success is primarily concerned with outcomes and achievements customers realize from using your product or service. It's about ensuring that your customers crush their goals and maximize their desired value. Customer experience, on the other hand, concentrates on the overall perception and feelings a customer has about their interactions with a company. It includes every touch point or interaction a customer has with the company. The danger is that customer experience tends to hinge on a desire to be liked, which in turn can lead to competing on the lowest common denominator. It's like saying all things being equal, pick me because you like me. People will also glorify the notion of satisfying the customer at any cost, even though the cost of satisfying the customer may be unsustainable. You are not in business to be liked. Generally, you can't afford it. So you have to be satisfied with being respected. Customer success is about helping the customer be successful and appearing hyper competent. Your desire is not to impress, but to be consistent, ensuring everyone has the same high quality experience. The benefit is that you can manage your costs and you don't nurture a culture of treating customers differently. You go to market with competitive assets like strategic networks. Strategic networks are like managed ecosystems they provide you with the support and scalability you need without the added cost. As we start to wrap up, you may want to watch the video on making a customer success manager your first hire. You owe it to yourself to maximize your strategic business plan and ensure that every element works effectively. Far too many people work way too hard and earn too little from their online businesses.